Let's get ready to go to dance. I haven't done one of these in like such a long time, especially a dance get ready with me. It's definitely been like over a year since I've done one of these, but I have rehearsal today. So I thought we would get dressed together. I have two rehearsals today and normally for rehearsals, they want you to wear all black, but I haven't heard anything. So we're just gonna, we're gonna wear some dark colors, but maybe not black. I have a lot of rehearsals over the next couple days and weeks. So I'm not trying to, wear all my black as quickly as possible, you know? I'm gonna start out with these blue camo pants. I've had these pants for years and I literally love them. I think I've had them, no, I definitely have had them since ninth grade in high school. And I just, I can't get enough of them. I can't get rid of them because I literally love them so much. All right, this is what we're starting off with. I am gonna wear black on top. Oh, uh, I'm like, do I wanna wear these? I do like these, but I love my pants to be like super, super long. And these are like right there at the cutoff. Like if I go down, ah, I don't like that, you see? But hmm, is there anything I could do? I could wear green pants, but I don't know if that is like to stand out. All right, yeah, I'm gonna switch my pants. The reason I'm switching my pants is because I do love these. But at the same time, I feel like they're getting not small because like they're definitely the right size, but I wish they were bigger. I do. I really wish they were bigger. I kind of low key to get more pants. But anyways, let's change really quick. All right, yeah, I'm gonna start out with these green pants. Not me talking about how much I love those pants and then just ending up not wearing them. Yeah, this is more, this is more my vibe these days. <laughs> yeah, super big, super like wide at the end. That's what I love. The only thing I hate about these pants is they don't have pockets, but there's nothing I can do about that. All right, we're still gonna do black on top because you know, this is the real bright green. I'm gonna start out with this little black shirt right here. The rehearsals are for two street jazz combos. So a crop top is perfectly fine. If it was like hip hop, hip hop, like, Isabel Caps Hip Hop, I would definitely say maybe like a, a T, a, a little t-shirt or something, but crop top, totally fine. It's gonna look so cute. I wanna add more. Like I know I'm gonna be wearing black shoes, that's for sure, but I wanna add like a, I don't know, a thing, maybe like a vest. Let's, let's, let's see. Let's see what we can, what we can do. All right, y'all might think I'm a little bit crazy for this. Pause for the sirens. All right, y'all might think I'm a little bit crazy for this, but I've got two options. I mean, not even two options. I'm doing both of them at once. So it's really just one option and this is what we're doing. I don't have any crew necks to put around my waist. So I am gonna put this sweatshirt around my waist, but it's cool because this sweatshirt is actually my clothing brand sweatshirt and it's gonna have the little skull in the back. I think that's like absolutely adorable. I'm probably gonna wear this sweatshirt in the beginning of the rehearsal in case I'm cold, you know, just to like get warm Warm while we're just like doing nothing if we're just sitting there just a bunch of different reasons to have my jacket because personally I am always cold I always need to bring a jacket with me anywhere I go so we're tying this around the waist and I'm also gonna wear this vest as well I know you're probably like what the fuck to be like a vest and a jacket what's going on is it cold in LA to answer your question yes it is freaking cold in LA right now it was literally a hundred degrees last week and now it's like freaking 60s like and especially because these rehearsals are at night I'm gonna need both the jacket and the vest okay <laughs> let me tell you it gets brisk at night now okay we're we're definitely at the end of September anyways I think this is so cute. I was looking in the mirror, I was like, okay, I like this. Like, we can do that. That is super cute. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. And I feel like it's more elevated than just like, just this and just the green pants. You know, it's giving a vibe, it's giving a vibe. Let's put on a necklace. Where's my throw necklace? I love this necklace so much. My parents gave it to me for Christmas one year. And now it's just like my go-to necklace. Super, super cute, adds a little white with the white of the side of the green pants. I think we're ready to add some shoes. Let me add one ring. I don't even know if you can see, but I have this fake Cartier ring that I got from Melrose Trading Post for like $5. If you don't live in California, Melrose Trading Post is like this flea market. <laughs> It is. Yeah, it's like this flea market that happens every Sunday and you go through there and everything. That's where I got this ring, so don't think it's real, but it never comes off. So I'm gonna wear that as a little accessory as well. And yeah, I think we're ready for some shoes and then we'll be ready to go. I'm gonna wear my all black Nikes. I don't even know what these shoes are called anymore. 
Air Force Ones. They're literally Air Force Ones. How could I forget that? I'm gonna wear my black Air Force One so that it, you know, ties everything together. Okay, wait for her, because I literally ate this outfit up. Yeah, this is real cute. This is real, real cute. And I've been seeing a lot of people wear their glasses to dance now, so I'm gonna join in on that trend. I found them. Yeah, this is cute. This is really giving. This is definitely the most effort I've put into a dance outfit in a really long time. So let's all be proud of me. Claps. Claps around the room, claps in a circle, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Obviously the glasses are optional, you don't have to wear glasses. I'm also probably gonna take off my glasses once we really get moving and stuff like that because I don't want them flying off my face. Even though that probably won't happen, they probably wouldn't fly off my face. But regardless, the most important thing when it comes to getting dressed for dance is just making sure that you're completely comfortable in what you're wearing. You wanna make sure, you know, you can actually freaking dance. Like, and I can definitely dance in these clips too. Like, mm, 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 mm. boom. You know, like, but the most important thing is to feel comfortable. When it comes to dance outfits, you just wanna make sure that you're as confident as possible in what you're wearing. If you feel like something is limiting you, don't wear it because it's gonna make you pick at it all of class, trust me. Sometimes I would wear bikinis to class and if you don't have fashion tape, like, it can be a little scary sometimes. You have a little nip slip in there, you know? So just make sure you're just feeling confident in what you're wearing. Make sure that the outfit is gonna make you feel the best that you possibly if can. Anyways, I gotta go to rehearsal, but I hope you guys had such a good day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you friends. Mwah. Bye.